I'm Ethan Wyken, and I am an orchestra teacher at IJ Holton. I teach fifth grade orchestra, and I also teach fifth and sixth grade band and fifth and sixth grade choir. I actually started college just as a general, just as a regular music performance major, um, as a trumpet major. I'm not really sure what I wanted to do in education. And I started teaching more and more throughout college. I just really loved seeing uh, students get so excited about music and something that I really loved and being able to spread my passion and love for music and to be able to see other students start to love, love music themselves. It was just a joy to see, so I decided to go into education. My favorite part is showing the students how much they have improved at their instrument and all that they've learned. So I guess that leading up to that, all of the, the nitty gritty technical stuff, things on the instrument, um, that you might not see the progress in one day, but when you go back to a recording or you show the students a recording from three weeks ago of them playing, them see, wow, I've really improved on my instrument, I've really gotten better as a musician. Um, so the build up to that, that experience with the students realize how much they've improved and see that spark go off for them. I like to create more of a collaborative, respectful environment, um, especially with music. Um, the students are taking big risks in the music classroom. It's something really new to a lot of them. So I try to um, instill positive life habits in and through music um, so to help students become more respectful, work together well, and um, challenge themselves and build habits of practicing. So the music classroom builds habits that they can use all throughout life. Um, so that's what I try to do in my music classroom. I think if the students see that this is something that you absolutely love and you, A, you're not getting, you're, you'll never give up on them because it's something you absolutely love in life and you want them to experience that and they, they see that and they feed off of that energy and then they know that you're an expert in that area and they want to ask you questions about it and I always try to point out um, ways that they're doing well and ways that they're achieving uh, or ways that they're becoming a better musician so they know that they're reaching that goal as well.